The obvious differences between the county and the band are what is or isn't Indian country. The band views that Indian country includes all of the original 61,000 acres of the three northern townships of Malax County in the 1855 reservation. The state of Minnesota and the county's position is that it's the trust lands. And of course, if you, nothing in Indian law is simple, so you still have the argument whether Highway 169 is or isn't Indian country under a federal statute. That issue is in front of the Minnesota Court of Appeals. Maybe they'll decide it in that case, maybe it'll be decided on other grounds. But eventually we'll have an answer to some of these questions. The other area where we have a disagreement is whether or not <coughs> uh, 62690 requires the man to enforce state law whenever its officers are out there, or whether the man can decide when the officers are exercising state law. Now, there may be clear instances. After all, state courts decide that a state officer doesn't have jurisdiction over a civil regulatory matter for a band member on trust land, then the officer could only be acting under inherent authority as opposed to the state authority. Uh, but there's an awful lot of gray and very little black and white. And so I think what this is going to be is an agreement in which we see how it's carried out and see whether our differences translate into practical problems that require us to terminate the agreement or the band to terminate the agreement or whether we can live with it. For example, the county has made very clear to the band that it does not have authority in the county's view exercise tribal jurisdiction outside of the trust lines. And it's a serious matter from this county's viewpoint if that happens. And if it happens other than inadvertently, I suspect that if I was brought back here, I would recommend that the county proceed to terminate because it implicates the reservation boundary issue. So it's, we've got a uh, dispute resolution mechanism. Each party's agreed respectfully to agree to disagree to not waive their respective claims as to what, whether or not there is a reservation, whether or not uh, what is or isn't Indian country. And we're going to see how it plays out uh, over time. Either party can terminate the agreement on 30 days written notice. In other words, you don't have to have cause. You can just say, we don't like it. We don't like the way it's working out. The band's got the same right, the same power.